All right, everybody, we're back with another map by Kaz. This is his fifth map. His last map was Rugged Country. The one before that was my favorite, which was Hawks Bay. He also did the one before that, which was Taylor's Farm, because his name is Taylor. And also, his first map, though, was Kiwi. That's what got him uh, my notice to him and a lot of other people. And he was one of the first ones pretty much in 19 that I saw that had the multi-fruit. But Kiwi was meant to be like a star map, a place to start, and then you go from there. And, well, he's back at it again. Me and him has been discussing, and he said that I think Neil, one more person, has said something to him as well on doing a map that was a star map. I even talked about maybe doing a starter series. He, um to have us ones that doesn't know how to make maps and stuff to be able to go through step by step and to make the map that you want because that's half the problem anyway that's why these maps get thousands of downloads we want to try them that's why they watch my videos and farmer klein and nick and and tesnet and, and bob and all of them and and a lot of these other people out there that i'm just now meeting and stuff that they're showing you these maps and stuff to show you what you're getting and we just keep on looking and we keep on looking because there's always something a little bit that we wish we can do or have and I have downloaded a bazillion blank maps and I have showed them to modders and stuff and they say what well, has errors in it or whatever and so what me and Cass kind of talked about and what he has done is get you a map that you can work with and it's pretty exciting this is fifth map you're really going to expect a lot out of this now aren't you <laughs> so let's dive in and here you go and we're not going to need no mods there's no use in me going to the if i push escape you're not going to have really uh much other than saying to join us on facebook this one does have one field but if you look over here at the fruit types you got all your extra fruits and I think I will of course you're not gonna have nothing I mean you got this one part here but it's I mean you got no vehicles you got no uh, you actually do have a transport job that's amazing I did not know this but and of course the garage nothing this is for you to do the way you want there are so many placeable mods and so much now I'll show you a little bit about my inventory of stuff I'm not going I'm not going to post these mods most of them come from Facebook and I literally have hundreds in here but we got greenhouses we got cell points we got uh, buy locations i'm fixing to put this one in on my map that he showed me i mean we got milk and all these different things and more greenhouses and and pretty much everything we could ever want gates and i mean you just it, the list just keeps going on we have a ton of place pools now and now we got some housing packs and stuff as well so i downloaded a ton of those uh trees and we can make a little play area pretty much the size of what we want and if you don't want to use a lizard house there's also um you can use like um some of the any of the houses now that has sleep triggers there's a ton of shed options and stuff like that this map is giving you the ability to be able to uh, do what you want. And I'll leave this up because they got a lot of beautiful buildings and stuff and their mod placeables and stuff. So all you got to do is just get the map and just kind of play around with the editor stuff. You can throw down the government sign to get you some money going or playing money multiplayer and move some money over from one account to another. But another thing too, like I said, this what we couldn't get was really a lot of stuff that was like um, error free if you notice mine says a couple errors but that's all my, it says right there mods so it's just the fact that 
uh, I'm running mods is the only reason why there's any errors in this whatsoever and it also has a water plane if I remember right so this allows us to do what it is we want to do and I actually do some uh, kind of playthroughs with my kids and one of them was me as kind of like a pimp my ride episode as if it was pimp my farm equipment it was pretty funny the kids had a ball uh, all the family had a ball doing it we didn't know it were a guy called me out and challenged me to a race I've always beat my kids at racing but that episode my son actually did as good if not better than me and but it was a pretty funny episode with my kids as well so I wanted something I can kind of play around with I'm not that good with the editor and stuff and we needed stuff kind of made a little bit easier so now I'm gonna break away from all this beautiful landscape here and I haven't tried really anything with the editor to see if there's a, a water plane stuff and I'm pretty sure Cass says it was but here's what he wants you to do and what I would like for you to do if you make any kind of changes or anything at all and you need help with it then come over to Cass's Facebook that simple and I'm going to show you why you need to come to his Facebook. So I'm going to pause this now, make sure it recorded, so I didn't do all this for nothing. And I'm going to show you what I'm working on. Okay, so we are back, and we're back is my part of his blank map. And he has done a little bit of editing, but this is why I said you need to go see him. And that way he can help you make that map that he created for you to help you even more. I don't know if anybody else is doing this. I'm sure there's a lot of great modders out there that's gonna be willing to to help you out and all this. But he did this like a little, I got this about seven, eight o'clock in the morning after I just woke up and and I seen this and, it's, and I was looking for my blank map. I updated my map, but I was looking for my blank map, but I couldn't find it when I was scrolling through the maps. I thought at first I was like, oh, what did what was the changes then? But then I got to scrolling through and I seen this. And it says, dedicated to Kentucky and JD, the struggle is real. See, the name of my map is called The Struggle. And it's supposed to be role play, like I said. And I'm hoping to get my kids in on it and maybe even my viewers in on it. And it's going to be story based. It's going to be um, hopefully some fun. And um, that's what I'm kind of looking for forward to and he's even got the Maori is a uh, the indigenous uh, people of New Zealand and it basically translate into stay uh, strong my brother forever and ever or I'm pretty sure or pretty close to that and um, you know that means a lot to me I mean um, I always get kind of choked up a little bit when I see something that really means a lot and I've only felt this way about by a few people in this game, and Kaz, he had to do it too. So I, I really, I really love this guy, and I think, like I said, if you drop into his Facebook, you'll grow to love him as well. He's always in Mata.us, and always in the forums, and always on my videos and stuff, trying his best. He literally works at his maps and trying to make sure people are pleased, which is an impossibility. You can't please everybody. I can't keep people from hitting dislike, and he can't keep people from saying that his maps are no good. It's going to happen, but he fights so hard to try to stop that. But anyway, let's dive in and see my map. Okay, so for mine, I was going to have like a little woods. I was going to get up in the air. That way y'all can kind of look around so i don't know why i picked a building where's my pressure washer there it is okay so mine is my family owns a sawmill and i'm going to add some sounds of the sawmill cast family some and basically i've been there my whole life and i'm sick of it i'm sick of the sound and everything else my dream is to kind of be like the people on the other side of the river and in towards town and stuff and do farming and stuff so this right here is going to be 
the only cell point and gas station is going to have kind of multi functions and the bridge is going to be all wore out and everything else but as you can see i've got water and stuff uh kaz helped me out with that and he's also put some force and stuff in back there at the back you can see that so i've already got a little bit of a start on mine but this is mine thus far plus it's a barn for sales so mine is going to be the struggle the kind of growing up and not really having much money and wanting to make it in this world but get out from beneath what my family's always done do something else be my own person kind of follow my dreams and that's that way not only for millions of americans but millions of people across the world kind of leaves everything they've ever known to just have a chance at pursuing some kind of life somewhere in a way they feel that they should so this one's mine so far and um, you're welcome to look at it get ideas from it i will not be posting my mount for download unless somebody's actually playing in multiplayer and helping me with the skip be the only way you'll be getting this mount it is for kind of private and and the thing about it is it isn't that i don't want anybody to have it it's just it's always going to be changing and stuff like that and you can take the blank map that he's given you and i'm sure i'm sure he will help you teach you show you and uh things you can do like i said it's multi fruit ready and everything so that's kind of where i am with mine and i'll be there i'm one of the moderators in his facebook page so get your maps and we got tons of placeables now and let's kind of play around with some maps and stuff a little bit i mean we're not really working with editor we're not doing anything major but we can create that little story in our mind that we want to play through so give a download a try and um come over and share your story with us i would love to hear that i think that would just be flat out awesome so take care have fun be sure to like and subscribe more to come guys